Hello. A warm welcome from my side. I am Priyanka Tandev, currently working in Synergetics Learning Service. I have more than seven years of experience in delivering IT sessions, covering from back-end technologies to front-end technologies and database management. I deliver sessions on Java, Spring, Spring Boot, Hibernate, as well as I cover the front-end technologies like Angular, React. So today I'm going to speak about an important transition in Spring ecosystem. That is from Spring Framework 5.3 to Spring Framework 6.0 and Spring Boot 2.x to Spring Boot 3. There is a lot of foresight and assumptions going on in this area because this transition is still going on and the release is expected in November 2022. Spring community is working on many areas of Java to bring this new release with proper compatibility. Spring Framework 6.0 will be the new beginning for new generation of Spring. Already, the main development branch has been already established in September 2022. So we are going to showcase on various topics like baseline upgrade, milestone steps to switch to Spring Framework 6 and Spring Boot 3, upgrade to Jakarta 9, third party support changes, Spring Native and AOT, observability matrix and traces, some new annotations, building applications with Gravel VM version. Spring Boot 3.0 will require upgrade to Java 17. Also, a top level package from Java EE8 is going to replace with Java EE9's new package that is Jakarta. Also, there are many dropouts going to happen. For example, Spring Framework 6.0 has decided to drop some outdated features like some core container features. For example, auto wiring setters by name and type. Also, many third party integrations with Spring are going to drop out. So let's upgrade ourselves with this Spring Framework 6 and Spring Boot 3. Thank you.